Okay, so I've got a couple requests for videos to show. The first one's going to be how to burn in bulk to get your gold out of your um, crops, like your barley and your corn. So I only have two barley right now, um, but I will show you how to do it with that um, so that you don't have to click on every single one in the game to exchange for gold. So you can see I'm going to log in here into my game. Okay, so if I go to my chest, you can see I have two barley right now. So for me right now, it'd be easy for me to just click exchange twice to get my gold. Uh, but if you have, you know, tens of barley or corn that you want to burn immediately to get gold, uh, you can do that over in Atomic Hub and that will save you CPU usage and having to click up exchange, you know, 50 times. So over in Atomic Hub, you want to go to your inventory. And to narrow down, if you have, you know, quite a few things going on, you want to narrow it down to Farmer's World, oops, sorry, food, and it will bring up your food. You can even narrow it down further if you have barley and corn by typing in, you know, barley. Okay, so I have two here and I want to go ahead and exchange those for gold. Just as a reminder, I have 108 gold right now. So what you do is you select all of them that you want to transfer and go under transfer. You then type in farmer's world make sure you spell it right. And in the transfer memo, you want to type burn and that's how it will burn it. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now and hit send transfer, confirm. Okay, so that should do it. So if I go over here, I'll probably refresh. And I had 108 gold. And you can see now I got, let's, let's do the math, 196 minus 108. So I got 88 gold. So I got an average of 44 gold for each of those barleys. But that was the quick and easy way to not have to exchange in the game, just transferring straight from Atomic Hub. So hopefully that helps. If you guys have any more recommendations for videos you want to see, or um, if you liked what you saw today, go ahead and comment in the comments below. Subscribe to my channel for more Farmer's World tips and how-tos.